So three of the Camino lessons I picked up this time. <clears throat> One was try not to judge because you never know someone else's circumstances. All right, that was number one. So, tip giving. Julian, this guy, I know he is. Tip to everyone. <laughs> he doesn't judge because he thinks that everyone's just hand, holding their hands out. It's Jesus. He's like, ah, it was Jesus. I just blew it. So I'm walking by this dude going, oh, man. So I have a bunch of little coins in my pocket. I walk by this dude and I go, after hearing Jalen say this, I'm like, Damn it, Julie. <laughs> I turn around and give the guy a tip. So, cut down on your judging. Me. This is a rule for me. I don't intend this for anyone else. It's just the way I remember it. Second one's after this chocolate milkshake. Cleanse your body. Stop eating shit. <clears throat> so do something to clean out your system and start eating better not only you live longer you feel better that's another that's a big one so that's somebody can start way back when they get back another good tip right <clears throat> one was turn off all social media and do not try to solve the world's problems because you can't. You don't make a difference. So it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Make changes in your own life. That's not a tip for me. Why talk about politics? Why talk about anything if I can't change it? Very good tip. That's my Camino tip. Alright. Next one. Talk to this guy. <clears throat> Turned off all his TV. Turned off his Netflix, his TV, he's watching all of it, right? Every bit of it. It's because what he said was <clears throat> when you're sitting there, you think you're relaxing, but your mind is watching these thousands of frames go by. So it's an overdrive process of this information. Even though it looks like it's a movie and you're kicking back, drinking, doing something, you are running a race. And not only is your mind working at so many frames per second to digest this movie, but also your organs are too. Every process in your body is sped to this level. So while you're thinking, you're just you know sitting there doing nothing. This is your downtime. You're still running. You're still at work. So, <clears throat> when he turned it all off, he went through kind of a, you know, the, the word for it is detox or a, kind of a depression, like, oh my God, what do I do? I'm going to think it too much, you know? And uh, he went through a, what the hell is the word? <clears throat> Nothing. A sobriety thing. <clears throat> but after a while, and say, hey, you gotta watch this movie. So after a while, he watched this movie. The next day, he felt like shit. He's like, oh, that's right, I watched it. After being so long without it. So, there's the social media side, then there's the TV watching side. <clears throat> you can cut that out. And he does a lot of audiobooks because his mind is creating those pictures as opposed to being flashed in front and showing the pictures where he doesn't have to think. There is a difference there. That's another one. Third Camino lesson I got was when you are doing those, you know, your body is like going through this thing and you're, you're drinking beers, you know, too many, some taking drugs, whatever the deal is. I'm thinking that there's a link to that Basically, you're just having too much going on. <clears throat> new things you're trying, new things you're doing. And so, complete sobriety is another big one. So, that's another fourth Camino lesson. And these are the Camino lessons I want to start 
implementing into my life. So let me see it. I'm going to give it a, a really good do. So I'm already talking down my failure. These are failed. But all these things I picked up are very valuable. So I still need to process them, but that's my rough draft.